Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Kimbo here and it's time for an epic, epic unboxing. So we got this box right here. Gotta open it up and see what we've got. Oh, we've got this! Okay. Yeah, big time hype. And there's a bunch of packing peanuts and I flung them everywhere. But I don't care because this is big time hype, dude. We've got this. It is the epic Bakugan Geogon Rising Elemental Fenica Ultra. Yeah, Elemental Chaos Fenica Ultra. Ultra man, or not? Hey, House, um, Aquas, yeah, uh, Aquas Fenica Ultra, which is really interesting to see. Like, I first thought it was Hey, House, but got too hype and saw the symbol. But yeah, it is Aquas Fenica Ultra, and it's interesting to see that. I guess just because they have like Diamond Fenica Ultra, you know, and they wanted to do another elemental, so why not switch Fenica and give it a little recolor and such in Aquas and. Also, just Elemental Rare. You already know. You can tell it's on Elemental Rare because you can see the fade right there with it, dude. Just so, so awesome. And with the Elementals, they have, like, the special uh, printing for them. You know, the special patterns printed on the Bakugan. And, uh, yeah. It's going to be awesome just to see how it looks with uh, the Aquas design on it, on its back. But overall, just the translucent plastic. All of that translucent turquoise looks amazing, dude. Looks so good. Man, she looks like an absolute gem. Just so, so sick. Uh, got the art right there. You know, not the Aquas art or anything, but, you know, just regular Chaos uh, Fenica's artwork, which is all good, man. But, yeah, so you can see right there, Elemental Rare Fenica Ultra. Comes with a background course, character card, ability card, all that good stuff. And then we got the uh, background for this wave. So it'll be like, what, wave four for the ultras? Like the ultra singles? So Diamond Pinsitar Ultra, yo. Uh, Elemental Rare Aquas Fenica Ultra. Arlis Shark Tar Ultra. Uh, Ventus Demork Ultra. Aquas Pinsitar Ultra. Chaos Drago Ultra. And then Pyrus Fenica Ultra. Which we have seen that uh, before, like it came with uh, the set, you know, the the starter deck set. But yeah, man. So um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, at the time of uh, filming this, Fenica, Shark Tar, and the other Fenica are the ones I've uh, reviewed and such. So I'm the on the lookout for the others. But yeah, man, still way four. Crazy to think we're getting towards the end of Geogon Rising, man, because you know we're in October now and. Uh, yeah, they start it always like the beginning of like the next year. So we're at the very tail end. It's crazy, man. But even what they have planned for like the rest of this year and going into uh, season four. Uh, I'm so hyped about season four, man. It's going to be awesome. But uh, yeah, so anyways, uh, let's get into it. Speaking of season four, uh, I'm definitely thinking about doing a thoughts video. I mentioned this in, the other, in another video. Um, I've been thinking about doing just like a thoughts video or what I want to see. Like, a type of video on what I want to see and hopes for uh, Season 4. If you guys want to see it, definitely let me know in the comments, because I'm totally down to do it. Uh, yeah, because <laughs> with there being another season, that makes a whole realm of possibilities, and you know I'd have a ton to talk about. Ah, oh, crap. And the dang tape trolling me again. Alright, well, there we go. Gotta get, gotta get the cores. Not worried about the sheet. Yeah. And honestly, that sheet, I'm, I'm not worried about that either. But all right, got to get Fennec out of there. Well, wait a minute. Plastic, plastic strip. I see you. I got you, bro. The man. Let me get you. Uh, there we go. All right. Yo. Oh, my Lord. Dude, oh, it looks so good. Okay, I can't wait to get into this. This looks so, so amazing. Uh, all right, so... We've got Barbetra on the gate card, so 100, 300, 600, 300, 200, and 100. Ventus getting the big time boost by far, for sure. And yeah, man. Also, like I said, peep the new uh, phone, you know, hence new camera. A lot brighter colors and such with it. Oh, man, I love the quality. I've been testing it out, and I just absolutely fall in love with the quality already, man. So we've got a uh, regular fist here, plus 100. Aquas and Pyrus getting plus 3. And then we got the shield here, Aquas and Pyrus getting plus 400, so both very, very good cores for it. So, uh, yeah, man, just flip the cards, and now we gotta get into it. Alright, guys, so we've got Fennica here, wait a minute, is that, that, wait, okay, then this is, yeah, it's misprinted packaging, huh? 
Okay, so this Fennica overall has a misprint with its packaging. So I was right at the beginning. It is Chaos Fennica Ultra. Like, I wondered because it had, like, Chaos Fennica on there, but it had the Aquas element to wear. Simple, you know, uh, it's easy to get that, like, misconstrued. And honestly, looking at it, I'm like, oh, okay, Aquas, I guess it makes sense just because of the colors with it. But, like, yeah, now to seeing more of the turquoise and such, yeah. Um, yeah, it is. Okay, so it is Elemental Rare Chaos Fennica Ultra. All right. So, yeah, so just a little bit of, like, a typo with the packaging for sure. But regardless, it looks amazing look at all the translucent turquoise plastic that they put on this man looks so good the entire body the entire body man a little bit of like the uh sky blue right there and also the white in the middle and then you can see it's like the chaos it's like wind a little bit you know like the white patterns and such that have been printed on the ears just so so awesome dude looks so great and then the white paint right there and even on like the back parts of the wings the side parts of the of the like wings on the tail i guess but still having uh the printed pattern right there just looks so cool she's gonna look amazing in the ball form for sure man and uh b power of 800 yeah okay so yeah it's definitely the chaos version because those are the chaos uh Fenica ultra stats so, yeah, my apologies for saying Aquas at the beginning. I mean, that's what the packaging said. And I honestly bleed for a bit, but, uh, yeah, it is chaos. All right, well, going to fold her up. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. And then the tail, clipping all together. And, dude, look how amazing she looks in the ball form. Elemental Rare Chaos Fenica Ultra looking so sick in the closed ball form. Honestly, like, closed ball forms for this season this is top five no doubt about it like really impressed with this it looks so so good man it looks really really good as an elemental rare and just the printed pattern on it man it's been master you outdid yourselves this is awesome this is so so awesome but yeah so now we gotta get into the cards so we got flash attack Reminds me of uh, <laughs> of Beyblade a little bit, uh, you know, because Metal Fight, like, Bao had a special move, Flash Attack, but, you know, it's a, especially doing MFB on the series battles recently, but, yeah, just, <laughs> I just thought of that at first, but Flash Attack, two cost, plus five for the damage, and then everybody just, yeah, getting hit big time by Mutasac, not playing around at all. And then we've got Chaos Fenica Ultra, so, yeah, Elemental Rare Chaos Fenica Ultra, um, B power 800, damage of 2. And then uh, she's got a shield and a fist with it, you know. So, breaking a 1,000, you know. I mean, can get up to 1,202. So, definitely breaking a 1,000. And then even with the regular fist, either 905 or 950 and uh, 4. Which, almost breaking a 1,000 even with a regular fist. But also, Holy Flame set up uh, for a deck, you know. Could definitely use it for that. Because, honestly, the Holy Flame, like, fist plus 600 one cost yeah nice card for sure and really nice with regular fist decks but yeah man so now time to get into the rolling action i'm gonna put the cards on both sides just to see if i can like get it i'm trying to get the chorus for sure all right let's see uh three two one and oh it tried it definitely curved all right come on oh no 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 this is going to be fun. We might be here for a little while. Maybe. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, man. That was that was a pretty good roll, too. Okay. Let's go. Bop. Oh, my goodness. That slow down. All right. Potatoes. You curved on that one. Oh, she wanted it. Okay. This way. Reverse. Reverse psychology. Oh, no. Oh, that man was right next to it, man. Okay, I got robbed with that one. All right. Let's go. Hey, there we go. With the perfect flip open, dude. Let's go. That was awesome. Uh, let's see. Is she strong enough to pick up two? Doesn't doesn't seem like it. Well, if she lands like this, then, yeah, can pick up two. So, honestly, it's better. She does land with, uh, you know, like landing on the back and such. Because then the tail can pick up both course you know it's really really strong magnet but yeah man 
Elemental Rare Chaos Fennec Ultra looking so, so epic, man. Like, completely just an absolute gem. It looks so, so good. If you can find this in the store, definitely pick it up because, like, it's great. Honestly, for Fennica, this is probably my favorite Fennica Ultra for sure, like by far, because I just love the pattern on it. But yeah, man. So, anyways, that is going to do it for this review on this absolutely amazing Bakugan Geogon Rising Elemental Rare Chaos Fennica Ultra. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to slice that like button down below. Let me know how I did. If you're new to my channel, definitely be sure to subscribe for some epic, epic content because I upload daily. And if you haven't already, be sure to ring that bell by my channel name to be notified whenever I upload a video. So, yeah, guys, until next time, it is your boy Kimbo signing off. See you guys later. Thanks so much for watching. Until then, stay awesome and Bakugan Brawl. I'm up out of here.